Hello everybody, it's Randy from Jacob's Triangle Homestead. Welcome to the channel. What I am wanting to do today is I want to finish up my series on the Grow Where You're Planted series that I started with the, the lettuces. My objective was to see if you could grow some lettuce indoors, completely indoors, and you know, have some food. I consider the experiment to be a partial success because if I would have harvested the lettuce a lot earlier, it probably would have been pretty good. But it did grow. It didn't grow as much as I expected it to. Um, I was using what I refer to as a Cog Hill style grow lights, and that is um, LED shop lights. If you are subscribed to the Cog Hill Farm. Jason over there uses um, LED shop lights for grow lights for his seed starts. They work really good for that. For growing plants out to maturity, they don't work so well. And I had seen somebody had commented on somebody else's post or video about making a grow light with an LED light that it doesn't have the right light spectrum for long-term plant growth. And I believe that's true because the lettuces, you know, they, they, they only grew about so tall and the spinach that I had planted, I forgot to mention the spinach, the spinach that I planted ended up bolting really early. It didn't hardly have any leaves on it at all, but it bolted. So I just quit watering that. They're just dead now. I'll end up pulling them out and stick something else in there. There's some herbs that my wife wants to grow. So we'll probably grow grow herbs in that container now. So anyways, I'll show you some pictures of the lettuce now. If you remember several years ago, there was a beer commercial where the guy had the bitter beer face. That's what the lettuce is now. It's very bitter. And I've tried a couple of different things to try to unbitter the lettuce. And it seems like once the lettuce is bitter, it's bitter. And it's bitter because you know it's, it's aged and I think it was wanting to bolt also. So, I like I say, it's a partially successful experiment because yes, the, the lettuce did grow. And if I would have harvested it younger, it would have been very good. But I was wanting to get, you know, something more substantial. I was wanting to get it to the point where I could, you know, partially harvest and let leaves grow back, you know, come back and do it again. I believe that lettuce may not have been the proper choice for doing that. And, I don't know what would have been a better choice right off the top of my head. Probably some other leafy green that doesn't mature and get unpalatable. Because, you know, that's, I've, I've tasted the lettuce, you know, when I would go in there and water, you know, I'll pluck a leaf off of it and taste it. And, mm, it's bitter. It's badly bitter. One thing that I did see to try to fix the bitterness is chopping it up like you're ready to put it in a salad and putting it in a salt bath and letting it soak in the salt bath for a while. And then, you know, you rinse it and soak it again. I think it was in clear water and then eat it. It doesn't take all of the bitterness away, but it does make it more palatable. Of course, if you put enough ranch dressing on it, you know, it'll cover most of the bitterness too. But yeah, very, 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 very bitter lettuce. So that's going to conclude that experiment, partially because we are looking at moving out of the house. I'm gonna show you a picture of the window. It did not, it's an east, excuse me, it's a west facing window, but because of the orientation of the house, our house is right smack up against the fence. I can t take the screen out of my window and lean out and I can touch the fence. So that's not a window that gets a lot of light. That's why I was using the grow lights. Not having enough light and using the grow lights is what contributed to the lettuce not growing properly. And I think if I had a window that had better light or probably if I used proper grow lights, it would have been more successful. But using Jason's you know, starter grow lights, for seedlings, cool. For long-term growth, not cool. I want to end this experiment now because one, the, the lettuce isn't palatable, and two, 
we are working on getting moved out of the house. We're going to move into the trailer. Saw a video a few weeks ago that I put out about, you know, testing out the trailer, buying the trailer so that we can live here on the property. We're working on that. We've, you know, got, got a permitting in process. So, you know, I checked on it today and it's got another approval. I think it's got, you know, one or two more approvals before they approve it altogether. So in the trailer, I'm not going to have a place to do an experiment like that. So I do need to wrap it up. Same with this video. I need to wrap it up. So experiment, partial success, with the right, right plants and the right grow light, I think it would be successful. So with that said, thank you for supporting me. Thank you for joining the channel. Thank you for watching. And until next time, I'll see you then.